With this video, we will list the images in a gallery. If anything is not clear, please go to the Wepler documents. First we need to add a data source. Right click the data detail source. In the pop-up, choose data and click on server connect. Enter an identifiable ID. Select the list server action under images. The server action will supply us with a list of all of the images in the database. We only want the images for the chosen gallery. For this, we need to add a filtered data source using data view. Right click the newly created server connect. In the pop up, choose data and data view. Enter an identifiable ID. Choose the query in Server Connect as the data source. Refresh the page to update our changes. For the filter, we will set the gallery ID equal to the gallery ID in the data detail source. Choose the data view and image gallery ID. Click the data format button. Right click on image gallery ID. Choose operation and change to condition to equal to. For the operator, choose data detail and gallery ID. Click select and save our work. Now we will create the viewing area. To be able to see our page elements click the App Connect Mode button. Select the Add Images button and right click the parent row. In the pop-up, select Insert After, Row. Inside the row add a column. Inside the column, add a title and give it a class of H4. Change the text of the title to Current Images. Right click the title parent row. In the drop down select to add a new row after. Inside the row add a column. Change the width of our column to 4. For brevity, in this project we will concentrate on large screens. Further adjustments can be made outside of this video. Right click the container and add an image. Choose the column. We will make this a repeat region. Give the repeat a recognizable ID. For the expression we choose the data view source. Choose the image. Under dynamic attributes, choose images and image source. For the value of the source, we need to change the expression to a template. Enter the name of the gallery folder. Select the gallery ID. Enter the name of the thumbs folder. Select image file. Click select. Right click the image row. Add a row after.
Add a column. Add a button. Change the button text. Give the button some styling. Click the button row. Under Dynamic Attributes choose Display Show. We will only show this row when Data View has images to show. Do the same for the other two rows. Save our work and we are done. In our next video, part 18 of our tutorial, I will show you how to add multiple images. Thank you for watching.